Michael Mann and Neon dropped the first trailer for Ferrari, this brand new biopic starring Adam Driver, Penelope Cruz, and Shailene Woodley. Let's rev up our engines and take a look at this one next. <laughs> How's it going, Outlaw Nation? It's the Outlaw John Roca. Welcome to this trailer reaction for Ferrari, our first look at this new film from director Michael Mann. You know I love myself a biopic, and you know I love Michael Mann, so I'm very much excited to see what we're going to get in this teaser trailer for Ferrari. This one's based on the 1991 Brock Yates book here, the biography that he did on Enzo Ferrari. It's called Enzo Ferrari, The Man, The Cars, The Races, The Machine, and this one stars Adam Driver as Enzo Ferrari, going back to play another iconic Italian here, just like he did in House of Gucci. It also features Penelope Cruz as his wife, Laura Ferrari, Shailene Woodley as his mistress, Lena Lordi. And this one also stars Patrick Dempsey as fellow race car driver, Piera Taruffi. Jack O'Connell is in this one as racer, Peter Collins. Sarah Gayton as uh, Linda Christian. And Gabriel Leone as driver, Alfonso de Portego. It's set in 1957, before the infamous Mille Miglia race, during which De Portego's Ferrari race car blew a tire and he and nine spectators crashed and Ferrari and his company were sued because of it. So I'm very curious to see how much of all of this we're going to get in the trailer for sure. And uh, well, without further ado, let's bring that thing up and let's take a, uh, take a look at this first look at Ferrari. Love those old school cars. Oh, look at oh wow. Oh, there's Shailene. Okay. <laughs> Little friction. Wow. Look at the cinematography there. Look at the shots there. Beautiful. Okay, some family drama. Wow. Wow, no dialogue here. Everything just in images and shots. coming out this christmas nice okay all right so yeah no dialogue until the end with adam driver as ferrari saying you get into one of my cars you get into win. and you know for those of you who saw ford versus ferrari which was a fantastic film from james mangold there with uh, christian slater or christian uh, bale sorry and uh, uh matt damon that you saw how hardcore ferrari was and how hardcore that uh, pe those people were to win these races so seeing that element here in uh, the trailer was nice to see but uh you know kind of a genius approach to a teaser trailer let's see the acting but without any dialogue until the end let's see the reactions to each other let's see what the conflicts and the tension of all of this is but let's also go back in time and show what may have been the inspiration for ferrari to become who he was uh and then see his connection with his son clearly there's something massive here that happens with the death of his son something we see him hugging his young son and then we see him uh, you know, uh, down there at the uh, at the cemetery, uh, crying in front of his son's uh, uh, headstone. There, so certainly that's got to be an element of this. But then we see him with his wife, with Penelope Cruz playing his wife, and certainly the tension there. We see him with Shailene Woodley as mistress, so I'm sure that adds tension into that situation. Although I know that Europeans are much more supposedly advanced about that kind of stuff, but certainly it seems like it's causing tension here between him and Penelope Cruz. I love her as an actress. Really enjoy seeing her um, chew up the scenery and get some dramatic stuff to play so clearly it's uh she's gonna have a lot to do from what we see in the trailer here with her and adam driver and adam driver really loved the look uh the way they aged him up the hair everything 
looks like a really powerful, daunting character, an intimidating character to deal with here in this movie. So very fascinating to see how they're going to play. Are they going to play to show this guy warts and all, or are they going to play him as kind of possibly somewhat heroic by the end of the movie? Because you know Michael Mann doesn't always play his uh, lead protagonists as straight heroes, you know, from a number of films, from Thief to Heat uh, and other films, they're not always doing the right thing all the time. Except for maybe Last of the Mohicans, they're not always doing the right thing at the right time. And so it makes it an interesting character study for those of us as viewers to watch and maybe take a look at ourselves by the end of those movies. So I, I'm looking forward to this. Love the racing scenes, the cinematography, the shots, the visuals. All of it look really cool. And I think it shows a certain amount of guts to do a trailer where there's just the imagery and the music and no actual uh, dialogue until the end. That shows, uh, I think, confidence in your film and that you're shooting an epic movie here uh, in Ferrari. So we'll see when this one comes out because they haven't announced uh, when this is coming out uh, because this is still looking for a U.S. distributor. And it is an independent film, according to Michael Mann. It had nothing to do with the studios. It's done with Neon, but they're looking for a distributor. And he, th he said in a recent interview that he was really proud about that in light of the SAG and uh, WGA, oh, SAG after and WGA strike. So uh, I'm down with that. I appreciate that approach. Well, what did y'all think? Did you like it? Did this uh, excite you? Did this inspire you to want to see more here? Uh, are some of you going to go get the book now to maybe read it before the movie comes out? Let me know down in the comment section below. What'd you think of Adam Driver's look? What'd you think of the imagery and the scenes we got? in this trailer and uh, how much are you looking forward to this one let me know down in the comment section below hit a like on this video share it on your social media and you know more than anything else please subscribe to the channel down below hit that subscribe button hit that bell button so you see when we're dropping all the content we do here on the outlaw nation channel all right y'all take care of yourselves be well uh don't uh, forget uh we've got a ahsoka spoiler review coming later from the geek buddies and i'll talk to you next time with another brand new reaction video here on the outlaw nation Thank you.